the very next square that we head into, once we have started in that center square view, the second square is your target audience. It's taking a look at what is the ideal target audience for you to work with in providing your product or service. Again, in the swimming pool industry, before we thought this through, the target audience could be anybody with a swimming pool. And when we got more specific about what it is that we wanted to offer, we could get a lot more specific about the target audience that was perfect for us. So the target audience is going to include an exploration of the target audience demographic. The age ranges, the male versus female, who's more likely to make those buying decisions, and then some of the common tendencies or characteristics of the audience that you are going to be working with the most. Right, so personality comes into play because certain personalities and types of people buy certain things and act in a certain way and, and the more that we can understand who's buying our product or service, the easier it is to put it in that consumable form. So the target very much becomes how do we design things around this person because now we know more about them. We know their age, range. are they male, are they female? We know what their tendencies are, what they like, what they want to do, where they hang out. We start looking at all of that part of it. Now our message can be crafted for that. 